Nearly a dozen people drown each year in the Great Lakes because of dangerous currents. Now that summer's here, thoughts turn towards family vacations on the beach and swimming in the surf. But before you go on that next trip, experts at the Department of Natural Resources and the Coast Guard have some advice to keep you and your loved ones safe. Our swim areas are marked with buoys. We ask you to stay within the swim areas, especially near the pier. Swimming near piers or structures present a lot of obstacles, boats, underwater objects, and structural currents. Our best advice is to stay away from the piers altogether, for the rip currents there could be dangerous. A rip current is a current or a river that goes out away from the shore. If you get caught in a rip current, swim angled towards the shore. Even an Olympic swimmer would have a hard time swimming directly in that current to get back to the shore. For small children and inexperienced swimmers, life jackets are a must. Many state parks have life jackets for you to use for the day on a lone basis. Take it off, put it on, and enjoy the water. If you see someone in trouble, throw them something that floats. Please do not become a victim. Call 911. Activate the 911 EMS system so first responders can respond to the scene to help. Before you head out to the beach, look at the forecast. See what the weather's going to be. A lot of stuff you want to look at to help enjoy yourself at the state park.